What's going on YouTube? Suicidal One here and welcome to another one of my videos. Uh, thank you very much for checking out the channel. And as you saw by the title, to act, you know what, actually, first of all, I'm living in the past today. You know, I've never worn this shirt. I was kind of just holding on to it. And uh, this is the back-to-back -back Miami Heat Championship team shirt when they won. And I'm, I'm lame like that. I'm just, uh, I decided to break it out. You can see the wrinkles. It's been folded up for a couple years now. But anyway, back to the shoes. So uh, today's video is from brought to you by Champ Sports. As you can see here, they're getting fancy now. Got the little card here. Uh, today's the shoes. Bleh. Today's shoes are the uh, Nike Flight Hirachi, which I'm gonna be honest with you. Not that I'm ever uh, not thankful for getting free shoes, because I mean it's a blessing. I can't even imagine. I don't know. It's it's something that I never thought would happen to me. I'll be honest with you, uh, but. There have been times where, you know, like I gave uh, the LeBrons to somebody who, that I got. I gave them to somebody who uh, had the basketball season coming up and, and they wanted, they liked them. So I knew they needed shoes. I gave them to them because it was something that, let's be honest, I can go without. So, um, but there have been a couple times where I've opened the package and I was surprised. The, the, uh, which ones that I reserve? The, the AM90s I really liked, but I was like, eh. I wasn't really into those kind of shoes. Put them on. Now I like them. I bought like three pairs since. So champs got me with that. Um, I'm trying to think what other ones I really liked that I was surprised with. Hmm. Anyway, I'm on the spot now. But let me let me be honest with you. On this Hirachi, now I've never owned a pair of Hirachis, the runner, the runners, or the flight Hirachis. And it's just a shoe that I never saw myself. I never saw myself buying. Now, uh, what I decided to do is I actually put it on. I don't know if you can see it. This is the one that's on. And <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you, it makes me wanna buy more of them. Now, this colorway, I wasn't really particular about it. I kinda opened it up. I was like, oh, yay, oh, the Hirachis. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> since then, I've tried them on, and I'm gonna give you guys an off-feet look just so, to see how, so you can see how I wear them. Um, but this shoe, with the exception um, I'm trying to think of that Adidas Prime Knit, the correct size. Probably that Adidas is one of the most comfortable shoes I've ever worn. Uh, there's been some other shoes that are that are okay, but this shoe, the I only had the right one on, and the right one fits me probably better than any shoe I can think of recently, only because of the the sock, uh, the LeBron the LeBron um, 12 Low. Those fit me really well too because it's got like that you know form fitted. Uh, sock in there, but these are the same way. They fit me really well. The toe box, I don't know if it's because it's set up really wide. You know, I have that wide foot right here and it fits me perfect. So I'm probably going to look into buying maybe a color, a different, a couple different colors of these. You guys got any ideas on any good colors? Let me know. But I know another, a bunch of other YouTubers got these, so you've seen them. Uh, you know, you got the purple strap here, the blue and purple color blocking with the black on the outside. I'm not gonna waste your time. I'll, what I will do is I'll give you a look at the, what I thought was probably the best feature of this shoe. Uh, not feature, but I was really impressed. Let me see if my camera will, yeah. Uh, with the leather on this shoe. It's real soft, real quality. It's not, you know, this isn't like the plastic leather that you see sometimes, especially on the regular Nike products. So for whatever this shoe costs, I'm really not sure. I think it's one, it's in the low 100s. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, and I believe the shoe drops on the 24th, uh, which is today. I'm taping this or recording this, not taping. We don't use tapes anymore. But, uh, so I'm really impressed. I'm going to go on champsports.com myself, maybe order if I find a colorway that's really nice and uh, go from there. But I really definitely like this shoe. I'm going to cut to an on feet video of this shoe. But thank you once again, guys, for checking out my videos. And you know, I don't try and flood you with videos. I give you guys the early looks and things like that. Um, I got some other stuff that, you know, people haven't seen as far as the way of weight stuff that I'm gonna be putting up on my channel and uh, the Edition Boutique channel. Make sure you follow the Edition Boutique, good people, uh, good store. They're trying to establish themselves and bring you guys good stuff. But um, make sure you follow me on Instagram. I'm trying to post a little more there lately. But that's about it, man. Uh, let me know. 
you guys got any shoes you want to see that are in my collection, especially the way of Wade's that you haven't seen yet. Um, and that's about it. Back to this Hirachi. Nice shoe. Really impressed with it. But I'm going to get to the on-feet now, and I will see you guys later. All right, so as you, as you guys know, I, uh, I tend to wear my shoes loose. I don't really tie anything. If I do tie it, um, I kind of just knot them together and let them, let them hang there. Um, but this shoe, I will definitely rock loose, and it gives you the ability to wear it loose because of uh, how this is set up with the sock, you know? So normally I just kind of start out letting them all loose and do this number right here. And then I slide it on and see where I'm at. But I'm gonna put them on now, give you guys a good look on feet.